Have you ever wondered how powerful your punches are? Or perhaps you want to increase your punching power? Well, my friends, you're not alone. Punching power holds a significant role in the world of martial arts and beyond. It's that explosive force you unleash that could make all the difference in a split-second situation. Whether you're a seasoned fighter or a beginner just getting your gloves dirty, remember, there's always room for growth. Why not start by gauging your current punching power? This will give you a benchmark, a point of reference if you will, and you'll know exactly where you stand. From there you can set realistic goals and measure your progress. It's not about being the strongest or the fastest, it's about being better than you were yesterday. So are you ready to take your punching power to the next level? Let's find out how much power you pack in your punches. Let's get started. First up, we have knuckle push-ups, a simple yet effective exercise. Knuckle push-ups, as the name suggests, are performed just like your regular push-ups, but instead of having your palms flat on the ground, you'll be balancing on your knuckles. This minor tweak in your push-up routine can bring about a major impact on your punching power. Let's dive into the proper form and technique. Start by getting into a high plank position, but instead of placing your hands flat on the floor, you'll be resting on your knuckles. Make sure your fists are tightly clenched and your knuckles are aligned under your shoulders. Your body should form a straight line from head to heels. Now, lower your body until your chest almost touches the ground. As you lower yourself, keep your elbows close to your body to engage your triceps and shoulders more effectively. Push your body back up to the starting position, maintaining the straight line we talked about. It's critical to maintain the correct form throughout to prevent injuries and maximize results. Incorrect form can lead to wrist strain or other injuries, so always ensure your knuckles and not your fingers are bearing the weight of your body. Knuckle push-ups not only strengthen your chest, shoulders and triceps like a regular push-up, but they also work on your wrist and forearm strength. This is extremely beneficial, as a strong wrist and forearm are essential for a powerful punch. They provide stability and control, allowing you to deliver a punch with more force and precision. Consistency is key with knuckle push-ups. Start with a number you're comfortable with, then gradually increase the count as your strength improves. Don't rush it. It's important to focus on maintaining the correct form, rather than trying to do a large number of push-ups poorly. A word of caution. If you feel any pain in your wrists or knuckles while doing this exercise, stop immediately and consult a professional. It's always better to be safe than sorry. Remember, it's not about how many you do, but how well you do them. Next, we have Medicine Ball Slams, a fantastic exercise for developing explosive power. To perform Medicine Ball Slams correctly, you'll need to harness the power of your entire body. Start by standing tall, feet shoulder width apart, with the Medicine Ball in your hands. Lift the ball above your head, extending your body to its full height. Now, here comes the fun part. Engage your core and slam that ball down to the ground as hard as you can, as if you're trying to break through the floor. Remember to maintain control, don't just fling the ball downwards. It's all about precision and power. Bend your knees as you slam and follow through, letting your body descend into a squat. Now why medicine ball slams? This exercise offers a plethora of benefits. One of the most prominent is improved coordination. The act of slamming the ball requires your upper and lower body to work in unison, enhancing your overall body coordination. This is particularly beneficial for martial artists as it helps to refine their movements and make their strikes more effective. Medicine ball slams also boost your power output. Every slam is an explosive movement that engages multiple muscle groups simultaneously. This helps to increase your strength and power, which in turn can translate into stronger punches. But the benefits don't stop there. Medicine ball slams also work wonders for your core muscles. Every time you lift and slam the ball you're engaging your abs, obliques, and lower back. A strong core is essential for martial artists as it provides stability and balance, and is the powerhouse for almost every move you make. So the next time you're in the gym, don't overlook the medicine ball. It may seem innocuous, but it's a powerful tool that can help you take your punching power to new heights. With every slam, imagine yourself delivering a knockout punch. Third on our list are heavy bag drills, a staple in every martial artist's training regime. You may wonder why the heavy bag? Well, it's not just a sack filled with sand or grains, it's a tool, a platform, where you can practice to perfect your power punches. It's a silent opponent that helps you shape your technique, build your strength, and hone your speed. There are numerous types of heavy bag drills you can engage in, each has its own unique impact on your punching power. Let's delve into a few. Firstly, we have the power drills. 
As the name suggests, these drills are all about harnessing your raw strength. You're not merely throwing punches, you're throwing explosive bursts of power. Remember, it's not about how many punches you can land, it's about how hard you can hit. Next up, we have speed drills. Here, the focus shifts from power to velocity. The aim is to hit the bag as fast as you can while maintaining proper form. This helps increase your hand speed, which is crucial for landing powerful punches before your opponent can react. Then there's the accuracy drill. This is where you pick a spot on the bag and aim all your punches there. It's about precision, about striking the same spot over and over again. This not only improves your accuracy, but also helps develop a powerful punch that can hit the target. Lastly, we have the endurance drill. This isn't about power or speed or accuracy, it's about resilience about how long you can keep hitting the bag without losing your form or strength. This drill helps build your stamina, allowing you to throw powerful punches even in the later rounds of a fight. So remember when you're standing before that heavy bag, don't just aim for volume. Aim for intensity, aim for power, aim for speed, aim for accuracy, and above all, aim to endure. Hit the bag like it's your last round in the ring. Fourth, we have resistance band punches, a great way to add some resistance to your training. Now this exercise is a dynamite addition to your routine because it not only builds strength, but also enhances speed. Intriguing, isn't it? So, how do we perform this exercise correctly? It's quite simple. You start by holding the resistance band with both hands. Make sure your hands are at chest level and the band is stretched across your back. Now, extend one arm straight out in front of you like a punch, while keeping the other hand at your chest. It's important to maintain control and keep the tension in the band. This isn't about how many punches you can throw, but how well you can throw each punch. Now let's talk about the benefits. Firstly, resistance band punches help develop your chest, shoulders, and arm muscles. These are the key muscle groups involved in throwing a powerful punch. Secondly, the resistance from the band helps to increase the speed of your punches. Think about it. The more resistance you overcome, the faster your punches will be without it. Lastly, this exercise improves your overall coordination and balance, which are crucial for any martial artist. A well-coordinated punch is not only more powerful, but also more efficient. Remember, controlled movements are the key. Maintain tension in the band and keep your movements sharp and focused. Punch through the resistance and you'll punch through your limits. Finally, we have plyometric push-ups, an advanced exercise that requires explosive power. This isn't your regular push-up, it's like your push-up decided to level up and become a superhero. Plyometric push-ups are all about power, speed, and the element of surprise, much like a well-delivered punch. This exercise is designed to build upper body strength and power. It's like adding a turbo boost to your chest, shoulders, and triceps. The muscle groups worked in this exercise are the same ones that help you deliver a powerful punch. So, by doing plyometric push-ups, you're essentially training your body to punch harder and faster. Now let's dive into how to do these push-ups. Start in a standard push-up position, your hands slightly wider than shoulder width apart. Lower your body as if you're doing a regular push-up, but here's the twist. When you push back up, do it with enough force that your hands leave the ground. Yes, you're essentially doing a mini jump with your upper body. Land softly to protect your wrists and immediately lower your body for the next repetition. Remember it's not about how many you can do, it's about doing them correctly. Quality over quantity. It can be tempting to rush through them but slow down, focus on your form, and make each one count. Push yourself off the ground like you're pushing your opponent away with a punch. That's our top 5 exercises to increase your punching power. We've explored a variety of techniques from knuckle push-ups that strengthen your wrists and forearms, to medicine ball slams that work your core and upper body. We've examined the intensity of heavy bag drills and the dynamic resistance band punches, finally rounding off with the explosive plyometric push-ups. Incorporating these exercises into your training routine will undoubtedly enhance your punching power. But remember, progress isn't achieved overnight. It's the product of time, consistency, and the will to improve. Each day, each training session brings you one step closer to your goal. Don't be discouraged by slow progress or setbacks, they're part of the journey. Instead celebrate every improvement no matter how small. Cherish the sweat, the effort, and the determination you put into every punch. Remember the power of your punch comes not just from your muscles but from your determination. Keep training, keep improving and you'll surely pack a punch that's not to be underestimated.